Moving on now to the other controversy that has been triggered in Maharashtra where the MNS chief Raj Thakre's new saffron cry has come to the fore. Now days after Thakre warned against the use of loudspeakers at mosques and threatened to bring them down, the Maharashtra Navnirman Sena workers were seen countering the azan with Hanuman Chalisa. They played the Hanuman Chalisa at high decibel using loudspeakers at their Ghatkopar office in Mumbai. On the 2nd of April, while addressing MNS workers on the occasion of Gudi Padwa, which is the Marathi New Year, Raj Thakre had said that mosques using loudspeakers for azan at 5 in the morning were inconveniencing people in the neighbourhood. He even went on to say that the Hanuman Chalisa will be played at double the volume if mosques continue to use loudspeakers for their azan and it looks like his party workers have taken cue from that. बढ़िया मशीन इस वर्ती लागले ले भोंगे हैं खाली उत्तरवावे स्लाइड लाहत बात लगे नहीं तर आज संतो है अत्ता संतो है जा मशीन इचा बाहर है भोंगे लाखतील जैसा दुपट समोर स्पीकर लावाई चाहिए नहीं हनुमान चालीसा लावाई सा जा प्रकार या लाउड स्पीकर सा सकारी पास वाज ले पसंद जो त्रास हो तो कौनता धर्म था कुछ धर्म आप देख लीजिए लाउडस्पीकर जो धर्म बन रहा था लाउडस्पीकर होता क्या है now these remarks have triggered a big political fight there over uh, Raj Chakra's comment and the subsequent fallout that we saw of the Hanuman Chalisa being played out by his workers on loudspeakers. Arunil is with me for more on this. Now Arunil, Raj Chakra is being accused of stoking communal tensions there for his own political mileage because we do know that the MNS has not been able to make a mark in any of the elections that have fought. How has the state government though come out and reacted to this? Well, it was Sharad Pawar, the NCP Supremo, who first came out in the front and took an attack on Raj Thakre. If you look at it, uh, uh, po politically, both Sharad Pawar and Raj Thakre have said to be uh, uh, enjoying a good uh, uh, relation with respect to the political front. Many times they have, many times they have shared the same dais as well. But this time, Sharad Pawar was extremely critical of uh, Raj Thakre, saying that he is only stoking uh, uh, communal tensions. He is using it for his own political uh, gains, and also pointed out that nobody should take uh, Raj Thakre or the MNS party seriously because they have only one MLA uh, in the state of Maharashtra. But clearly, after Raj Thakre made those statements, there were MNS leaders across different parts of Mumbai particularly. One incident, incident happened in Ghatkopar wherein an MLS, MNS leader put up, uh, ha, ha, played Hanuman Chalisa on a loudspeaker. He was booked uh, subsequently. Similar kind of uh, in, similar kind of attempts were also made in Kadivli, also in uh, Charkop, in Borivli as well, wherein MNS leaders put up, uh, played Hanuman Chalisa on a loudspeaker. One interesting development that took place last night, Poonam, was uh, it was Union Minister Nitin Gadkari who went to the house of uh, Raj Thakre. They had a, a meeting. Now, what is the exact political significance of this meeting? Is there a kind of, uh, because the MNS has been very buoyant of having uh, a tie-up with the BJP for the crucial uh, BMC elections, the MNS has been attempting to replace uh, the Shiv Sena and that is why probably uh, the Raj Thakre has taken this new Hindutva role. That is the right. question that the MVA is also asking at present. Right. With respect to removing of loudspeakers from mosque is concerned, that issue was first raised by BJP leader Mohit Kamboj. Wherein right, and as far as that issue is concerned, the, uh, the state government has so far not reacted to it. But as far as Raj Thakre's comments go, uh, there is a big political fight that has ensued with all of Raj Thakre's political rivals coming out and saying that this is nothing but a gimmick to garner attention as his political stock falls even lower. फिर क्या करेंगे जिएगे कैसे कुछ तो करना पड़ेगा तो बोलने देंगे वहां अगर मस्जिदों पे भुंगा चलाते हो तो या ये लगा क्यों राज्यों के में क्यों कहो केंद्र सरकार को एक कानून बनाए और सभी को ये सभी बंद कर दे अगर वही है तो गुजरात में भारतीय जनता पार्टी की सरकार है कर्नाटक में भारतीय जनता पार्टी की सरकार है मध्य प्रदेश में भारतीय जनता पार्टी की सरकार है क्या वहां मस्जिदों पर भुंगे हटाए गए तो सिर्फ राज्य में क्यों क्योंकि महाराष्ट्र को तकलीफ देनी है बाकी कुछ नहीं है राज ठाकरे हमेशा डिस्ट्रक्टिव पॉलिटिक्स करते रहे हैं कभी बिहारियों के खिलाफ कभी गैर जो महाराष्ट्रियन हैं उनके खिलाफ और उनको लगता है कि ये सब करके वो अपनी 
पहचान बना लेंगे लेकिन हकीकत ऐसा नहीं है जब वो चुनाव में गए कई बार वो चुनाव में जाकर उन्होंने अपनी शक्ति का अंदाज़ा उनको हो गया है कि जनता उनके इन हरकतों से बिल्कुल प्रभावित नहीं होती न जाने किस तरह की नफरत इन्होंने किया असम्बली में हिंदी में भाषा में शपथ नहीं इन सब चीज़ों को देखते हुए जो उनकी सीटें थी ना जीरो हो गई ख़त्म हो गए वो और उनको लगता है कि मुसलमानों के कंधे पर चढ़ेंगे तो हमारी राजनीति चलेगी कि अगर आपको नॉइस पॉल्यूशन की इतनी चिंता है तो शादियों में बड़ा बड़ा डीजे बजता है आपने कभी आज उस पर आवाज़ नहीं उठाया मैं उनसे पूछूँ कि आज मुंबई में तीन चार सौ बी बार चलते हैं रात को फुल आवाज़ के साथ दो दो बजे तक वहाँ डीजे बजता है बाजू वाले परेशान रहते हैं और गणपति है नवरात्रि है दशहरा है दिवाली है सब में नॉइज पॉल्यूशन आज तक आपकी आवाज कभी नहीं निकली 